Hello there. If you want to retrieve your account from this code uh, using a two-factor authenticator, it's really simple. Uh, you are in the right place. But first of all, you need to understand one thing. So first of all, as you can see, I'm already into the Discord section where I can use logged in. And in here, you want to choose a forgot your passcode. So I'm going to choose this option. If this one is going to be asking you for a phone number, we're going to be creating here really quick an account. Go into forgot passcode. And in here, we have the enter your confirmation code to reset your passcode. So in here, we have the phone number connected to this account. Didn't get a code, resend code. If you don't get an account, uh, if you didn't get a code into your phone or you don't have a code, I'm going to go into cancel. And in here, I'm going to go once again into forgot my passcode. So what's going to happen here? And that they send instructions to change my passcode into my inbox of my mail. If I have enabled the two-factor authenticator, all my information is going to be tracked into the two-factor authenticator code in order to retrieve that. So in here, I'm in, right? So I'm going to go into my user settings. I'm going to go into my account. And I have to enable my two-factor authenticator in order to have this already, uh, let's say, enabled. What I'm going to be doing here is to open this authenticator application into my phone or into the other device that you want to have the two-factor authenticator. I'm going to scan this code and I'm going to use a code that appears into my phone, into my device. And here is the enable SMS authentication, download backups. I can download the backups if I want to, but if I just want to stick around with these options, what you can do is to once again put in here the forgot my passcode and it's going to be asking you for the two-factor authenticator and just in case you don't have even your factor authenticator, you have this backup codes that you can use to prevent that you will no longer have access to your account. So there, I'm going to go into settings once again. I'm going to log out my username, forgot my passcode. Now, instead of asking me for a code from my phone number, it asks me for the two-factor authenticator, which is really simple just to look around for that and just sign in real quick. So actually, it was a really, really easy setup. So there you have it, guys. Um, hopefully, this was a pretty useful video for you. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more about this kind of uh, backup stuff. So thank you so much for watching this video once again. Be really careful with your accounts and of course download all your backup cards so you can have access and you don't lose the access to your account. So thank you so much for watching once again guys and I will see you next time.